Hello everyone, greetings from Dubai Watch Week. So we are here at Mozart Desk and uh, my dear friend Bertram Maidan is here. So how are you Bertram? Very good, always happy to be in uh, Dubai Watch Week. And every year even better and better. Yeah. I think it's quite amazing. It's very exciting to have done a global launch for the first time in Dubai Watch Week. Yeah, this time we have more brands here, more uh, new releases here. So I think also there are more people and uh, I think it's qualitative quite fun, people. Huh? Yeah, qualitative people. Traveling from all over the world. Yeah. From here, it's crazy. Okay, if you ask the question, so are you going to expect the same uh, growth for the next edition? It's I mean, early to talk about it, but it's getting I very so, quick. I believe so, because it's becoming really a key place to come for collectors from around the world. Uh, it's in Dubai, people enjoy coming to Dubai, nice weather. Yeah. It's yesterday morning, yeah, yeah, yeah. it's normally very nice weather. Uh, it's a human side exhibition, meaning that everybody can meet everybody easily, uh, see all the watches easily, uh, which in other shows are often difficult. So I think it has the potential to continue to grow extremely strongly. Yeah, I mean, thanks to Dubai Watch Week, we are also able to see the novelties yes. and uh, put them on our wrist. So tell us something about the new streamliner. So I bought mine two years ago and now the, the second and the new one. Yes, so this is the streamliner small second. So a lot of new feature on this one. First of all, it's a new size. It's 39 millimeter, but also thinner at 10.9 millimeter, yeah, comparing it's one to this millimeter, yeah. mm -hmm. a bit more than one millimeter thinner. It's a new dial, it's an enameled hammered dial and a new complication with a completely new movement, which is a micro rotor. Uh, first time we ever do a micro rotor with this platinum micro rotor. New finish also on it, but it's a completely new movement that helped us also make a smaller thinner watch. Mm -hmm. Okay, now if you check the website of Mozart, we see only one or two streamliner. So what is the your idea for the future? Are you going to add some new models to streamliner line or uh, one discontinued and new one? So how, with, how the story will go? With Like all our collections, we try to keep all our collections as clean as possible. So often if you look, there is one, for example, this Macroto come only in one color. It's very clear that if you have this sort of dial, it's the, for the macro auto. It's the same we have on the chronograph with the funky blue on the chronograph. We have the streamliner perpetual that is only on one color, etc., etc. So we try to keep the collection as clean as possible. But yes, we need to continue to renew. There are some models that are existing today that we will discontinue, as you know, as we did typically on yeah, the watch, yeah, that we exactly. decide we love to stop a watch at its top of when it's extremely popular and not too late. And so we will discontinue, especially one next year. And in the same time, we need to continue to renew. So next year we'll have also a new complication, a higher end complication as well, but also uh, some more entry level that uh, we need to renew the Salmon that was for one year only. So that watch will be renewed as well as on the next year. Yeah, good. So today is a very important organization. I think the next one, we can say end of March, April, Watches and Wonders. What we should expect from Moser between this period? We have few. We have a special dial coming and on one of our higher level one in uh, early in the year. But our big novelty will be in Watches and Wonders. Well, okay. The streamliner. Okay, so I'm asking this because we received a lot of questions from our people. So I'm not asking the number, but are you planning to increase the number of the production or will you continue saying? We slowly increase every year. It's not easy. It takes time to go to find the right watchmakers, to expand the manufacturer. It tends to be quite tight now as it's uh, very full. Next year, we will probably increase a little bit the production, but only slightly. But as long as the demand continues to be as strong as well as today, the most important for us is, is the sellout, how many watches goes to the wrist and as long as it stays as high as it is today, we can slowly continue to increase. Yeah. It's not easy to increase uh, in your business, so it's just by pushing the button and increasing. Yeah. Finding watchmakers is very yeah. difficult. For yeah. Watchmakers yeah. that are capable of working sure. on the products, sure. 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 Uh, then you need to train them for a certain amount of time. Uh -huh. and from there, we can, uh, we can look. Okay, so Bertrand, thank you very much and congratulations for this uh, new Thank you very much. And, uh, so, thank you very much.